My name is Ron Kuzer. I portray Lord Pimpington. But I have a very interesting story that I would like to relate to you in regard to when I first became a reenactor. I happened to be in Mount Vernon at the time. No, excuse me, not Mount Vernon, but Valley Forge. And I was looking at the museums there. There is two museums in Valley Forge. One is from the, uh, the federal site, and the other one is from a private site, the Ladies of, uh, Mount of uh, Valley Forge. Uh, I went into that museum, and, and it was during the middle of the week, and it seemed like nobody was there, and they were loading boxes up. And I said, are you, I said to the lady who was there, I said, are you closed? And she says, no, but we're starting to move a lot of the exhibits out of here because we're going to be redecorating. And I said, do you mind if I walk around? And she said, no, I don't mind at all. So I walked around, and I went to one exhibit, and there was a glass case uh, with a mannequin with George Washington's waistcoat. And I was looking at the buttons, and they were kind of familiar in, in, in design, and I asked the lady if she knew anything about the buttons. And she says, well, what do you mean? I said, are they Masonic buttons? And she says, yes, they are. How do you know that? I said, because I am a Freemason, and I kind of had that kind of a flavor to it. She says, well, I'm with the Order of the Eastern Star, and that's the female branch of the Masons. She says, uh, we're about to take that down. Would you like to try it on? And I stood there and I, with my mouth open, and I said, uh, uh, sure. I wore Washington's waistcoat. And when I was standing there with it on, she says, now, would you like to hold Lafayette's pistols? And I said, sure. And there I was in the museum wearing Washington's waistcoat and holding his pistol. It does not get any better than that.